Door is locked. What do we do? Use sword on door. Didn't do anything. Sword is now broken. Use broken sword on door. Did not work. You stabbed yourself through the chest. The gods, the why did they damn me? You killed a snake, you can't beat the game now. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I'm sure that's from I'm something. I'm sure I haven't played that game. Um, it's a very old game. King's Quest 3, I believe. You killed the snake, you can now not beat the game. Yeah. That's what happened. Really? Yeah. What? Fuck King's Quest, <laughs> seriously, dude. <laughs> Why are King's Quest games so, like, difficult? <laughs> You'll never guess how you're supposed to, uh, get past that. Do Sing you to give it. it food? Sing to it. No and no. Dance. No. Do you walk past it? No. You guys will never get this. Turn into a snake. <laughs> no. Make love to the snake. No. <laughs> Do you move the snake? No. Turn into Bill Cosby. <laughs> Do you use a really, really unnecessarily complicated tool to make it let you buy? It is not complicated. Turn the snake into a gila monster. No. Do With... you find it a mate? No. Also, that's one of the easier ways to get that great Do you talk to the snake? No. Do you backflip over the snake? Think, like... um... Think in terms of adventure games logic. Oh, great. Um, put the snake and collect it? No. Ow! <laughs> I hit my tooth on a bottle. Don't do that. <laughs> guys will never get this. Honestly. I give up. You put it in a bag. It. No. I just said that. It's collecting it. And you don't feed it, you don't talk to it, you don't collect it. Do you adventure game no logic? Do you answer its question? Do you no. solve it? <laughs> no, sort of. No. <laughs> Is it like a like a snake that's actually like a Rubik's cube and you just no. keep turning it? No. Can you tell us? It I, has to do with an item that doesn't make sense. I don't. I don't know. Great, because you know I know every item in every King's Quest game. All right. Do you Let use me a shoe? You... Close. Do you use a shirt? No. Snake Pants. in the boot. You guys give so, up yet? Belt. There's a sink in horse terms. Horseshoe. No. Wait a minute. No, that wouldn't make any sense. Try it. Try it. it. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> uh, 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 Try it. Uh, horseshoe. Okay. Um. Does the horseshoe dispel no, it? No. No. No horseshoes. Oh, this is a thing I had to cut in. Yeah. So not a horseshoe. Not a um. Horseshoe. Fuck. Hold on. Is it, it shoes or clothes? No. And think about horses. Do you skid it? <laughs> Do you have no. a horse step on it? No. Do you ride it? Close. What? So close. You put a saddle on it and ride it? Yes. You put a saddle on it. <laughs> Why? How big is this snake? You put a saddle on it and it turns into a Pegasus. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why? You know what? I think I actually... No explanation at all. <laughs> Great. <laughs> King's Quest. <laughs> Buy it. Seriously? Snakes in a Pegasus. I'm Who gives say, a fuck? I'm going to say this again. Fuck King's Quest. <laughs> Monkey Island makes more sense than that shit. What's Monkey Island? I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Everyone just rips their head off at the same time. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm I've just... heard the name, but I've never actually seen it. So Everyone rips their head off at the same time. <laughs> You've never heard of it! I, I just never really played it that much. Everyone rips your head off. <laughs> hey, your internet. head is going off, okay? Internet, <laughs> calm down. No. Stop getting that... so mad. <clears throat> do, do you know the internet? They can't calm down. It's true, they all have freaking butt hurt all the time. Sorry, Kempo. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a point. So much butter. I did this wrong. <laughs> it's true. Like people getting butthurt about this temple. Uh, I think you were telling me, like, yes, I've been doing it on the floor forever. And I'm like, no, there's an easier way over here. Mm. I usually do do it on the floor. I don't know why. Because that's how the pros do it. No, that's how the stupid people that's do it. That's how Master Quest does it. Master <laughs> Quest has actually the exact same puzzle. 
It's true. Water Temple is easier in Master Quest. Hilariously. I think you even get some extra keys. Yeah, you do. You get, I guess, like, you get a key you don't need. That's always nice. I guess people were so pissed off about this temple they made it easier. <laughs> no, but it's supposed to be Master Quest. Uh, it's supposed to be harder. You know it would be funny if it was in Master Quest, the Water Temple was the same. Exactly the same. I would wonder how they'd make it harder. There's several ways. They take away your hook shot. You need to use the you need to use like the song of time. <laughs> now there's fire in the water. So time you blocks while you're in the water. Time blocks underwater. Yep. Yep. Yeah, you can't use your ocarina. All right. Back to what? Yes. All that pretty much happened later. Yep, it's in the future. This is a link to the future! Ah. And just imagine you have an extra key. Yeah, imagine I have one key. Imagine. It will appear later, just imagine that he has one at the moment. I like how you're skipping me raising and lowering the water levels. Alright, fuck the raising and lowering. Thank God for it. Wait, this did, temple. Did, did you? No, oh, I thought you did. I just stopped and turned around and looked. So no, I, I, I pretty much made it in order. Like, if. If you're playing along, you can do that in order. <laughs> yeah. I just I just missed a key my first time around, and I was pretty disappointed. Yeah, you don't even have to do the temples in order. No, you don't. You don't have to do the temples at all. You don't? <laughs> no. Not technically, no. No. You can skip all the childhood dungeons, become an adult, and skip all the regular dungeons, get into Ganon's castle, and... Beat Ganon without having the hook shot or actually having the bow and arrow. You Can you clip that? out of the Kakari, uh, not Kakari, uh, the forage, uh, the forest, uh, without any sword or shield? Well, you need a sword, but you can't. I like how we explain this. Past ones. We, we had to just did. explain it again for. Uh, I I ha I never explained how you do it, but yeah. If you want to, I mean, we got some time. <laughs> All right. There is a thing in the game called the infinite sword glitch, which is basically you can be trying to crouch stab while reading a sign or talking to somebody, and if it works, then your sword will have a constant white slash coming off of it as if you were attacking with it. And while it's activated, you'll attack anything automatically while you're walking. You don't even need to use the attack button, and you can't fall off with of ledges. So if you do that near the bridge of the Kakariko Forest, and use the god darn Deku Merchant Nuts, he can hit your sword, and during the infinite sword glitch, if you backflip at the right times, you can float in midair since you're not allowed to fall with it activated. So you can glitch out by using a Deku Merchant Nuts and the infinite sword glitch to get out of the Kakariko Forest. How'd you find this stuff out? I watched the video, I never did it. <laughs> Just people experiment, you know, when they love something enough, they, they want to know everything about it. And guess what? It's still in the remake on the DS. You can still do that. What? Nifty. Can't they recode that? I don't think they're going to. If they're going to make it for another system, why not just remake it from scratch? I don't know. Why? Because think about the priorities of Nintendo. <laughs> make money. Thank you one. for showing me, showing that it's not possible. Making, making a new game would be too much work for them. <laughs> it's just easier to repackage the old one and make it look a little bit more pretty. <laughs> no, I don't know if you can actually get out of the DQ forest still, but I know the infinite sword glitch is still around, so... That's about it. Huh. Okay, so this is floor two. Yep. I believe you can do this entire temple with only raising, well, lowering the water and then raising it, and then, well, okay, lowering and it. raising it twice. Really? Yeah. Because there, there, there is a key that you need to get where you have to shoot a bow into an eye and then long shot to it, and that's on the second floor. So you need to, you, you can't do it in one time, but you can do it in two. Did I it? love how hilariously short this timer is. I go to the wrong side. Hmm. Did anyone else t have an extremely... Oh, no, never mind, forget it. <laughs> extremely what? Finish your statement. Hold oh. on. Forget it for a minute, I'm trying to find the words. <laughs> I'm trying to words. Sounds like something I would say. 
Sometimes I can't get out what I'm trying to say, so give me a minute. This could take a while. <laughs> In the meantime, I got the map. What are we supposed to be trying? It'd be funny if while you were pulling it out, it was just like click, click, click. <laughs> nope. Yeah. yeah, well, the timer turns off as soon as you open the chest. Okay, I got it. Did it take anyone else an extremely long time to get through this dungeon? First time. Yeah. Yep. First time, yeah. Again. As, oh, yeah. As soon as we started doing this, I got flashbacks of little seven year old Tyler. Sitting in his living room. Was it a third person? Could you see yourself? Mm hmm. <laughs> from the camera I put in my yes. living room. Oh god, you're reminding me of my memories of this. There was a lot of yelling and there was a lot of anger towards this temple. I remember the first time I saw anybody play this game, I was watching them do Jabby Jabby's Belly and we couldn't figure it out. I just kept getting lost in this temple. I think the only part of Jabby Jabby's Belly that really messed me up as a kid was putting a box down on a switch. <laughs> <laughs> I could not figure that out for the life of me. Yeah. Also, I remember the first time I played this game myself, I had I got my my cousin came over and he had a game truck with him and I got the long shot that way. I completely I couldn't find one of the keys. And you're just cheating back then too, weren't you? Hey, I I haven't cheated in this. <laughs> what? I haven't. I what? <laughs> I haven't gained things magically through no efforts. Cricket, cricket. I, I, I've glitched. That's not cheating. Cricket, cricket. <laughs> You're all racist. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Hey. Not different races. <laughs> I guess you could be racist against your own kind. Hey, you can. It's possible, I suppose. Uh, they don't know that. I was so bad at games when I was a kid. Everyone was. This is true. I distinctly remember not being very good at Donkey Kong 64 when I was a little kid. Like, that Jack in the Box boss kicked my ass, so did the Blowfish. Yeah. I wasn't very good at steering that boat. How are you, Tony? I was just saying, the only thing that tripped me up in that game was not owning it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that would trip you up. Well. <laughs> yeah, I also had somebody else beat, um. Bongo Bongo, Twin Rova, and Ganondorf for me. Twin Rova's really not that far. Shut up, I was bad at games when I was a kid. I really, really was. I got, I got so much better. <laughs> Who was a hard boss in the <laughs> Um... Super Tech Fight. The last boss was pretty difficult. For this game? Yeah. yeah. As a kid. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um... It was. I had a hard time with uh, Phantom Ganon, but I did beat him. Phantom himself. Ganon was yeah, pretty Phantom tough as a kid, I too. Him. Um, pretty much all of the other bosses were pretty easy. I didn't have any problems with old Vagia at all as a kid. Damn. I also didn't have that many problems with Majora's Mask. I was a little bit older than I had beat Majora's him. Mask actually gave me some problems boss wise. Yeah. Yeah, Guy Org. Guy Org. I was hated Guy Org. Skyward was the only thing that gave me any problems. All of them gave me problems. Well, actually, probably not the first one. Ottawa? Yeah, I would be surprised if a kid you had problems with Ottawa. Well, okay. I didn't have problems with the first one. It was really annoying catching up with the second one. The third one was difficult, and the fourth one was practically impossible. Uh, while not using the mask. You you shoot with arrows. Woo. Yes, it still took a really long time to do. This saying you can win without the mask. It's like running out of energy. Difficult for the kids, know. Mark! I said it was still difficult. on the kids thing! <laughs> oh, yeah, <we> are. <laughs> Haven't changed the topic yet. And I this is the point where I realized that I was missing a key, and I'm like, oh balls. I didn't oh, say no. balls, but that would be funnier. What was the first game got? Link doesn't have any balls. I'm pretty sure he does. <laughs> nope, no balls. It's the best impression ever. Shh. Wake up! No. <laughs> Tyler, Tyler, we're at Dream God. Level 3. I'm you have to wake up. Sleep. The set it is or so strong. You didn't take any set of this. Oh! <laughs> Knock it off. Shh! <laughs> what was that noise? You are no. 
stupid tack dice. Dark tack dice. I don't care. <laughs> bitches. <laughs> hey! Why are you being so mean to the in-game enemies? They're so they're so cute and adorable because they can't do anything. <laughs> cute and adorable. Cute and More adorable. like deadly and lethal. <laughs>